We're here at SiliconAngle.com at the New York City Mega Launch Bench from EMC. Record breaking everything, 41 new product announcements, 26 people in the Mini Cooper, massive flair, New York City Times Square, great event, huge. Joe Tucci, Pat Gelsinger, the man behind it is Jeremy Burton, the CMO. Jeremy, congratulations on a great event. Um, you guys pulled out all the stops. Uh, you got up on your game big time now here at EMC. Yeah, well, look, you know, we're, we're looking out to next year and uh, we're, we're creeping up on 20 billion and hey, it's about time we started acting like one. So uh, this was a, a foretaste of things to come. Good mix of multimedia, great messaging. You guys pounding home the message, breaking records. Um, is that going to be a theme for the whole year? We're going to see more stuff around record breaking? Uh, absolutely. What we do after uh, we've completed the mega launch, well, we're going to, we're going to London tomorrow. Um, we, we start with our mega tour. We have a fleet of about 21 Mini Coopers that are going to be doing 108 partner kickoffs around the world, and the idea is to take this show on the road. We've talked in the past at the Cube events uh, about marketing and, and uh, your, your new role here at EMC, and you guys are introducing basically a full portfolio of products. You're going after new markets, you know, obviously you channel business with the, with the entry level products. The, all the executives are on board. How do you pull that together? I mean, Joe's in the car, he's in the skits, he's in the videos. How is this all coming together, and what's, the, what's your roadmap for the next year? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a big believer that, um, you know, we, we as the EMC team are empowered. I think, I think Joe does a great job creating an environment where we can innovate, um, but you know, we, can, we can also get together as a team, get on the same page and rally. And uh, we have that environment at EMC, and, and that's why you see the consistency of message. I mean, he creates the environment for, for I think, his exec team to thrive. Talk about the customers that are here. You guys obviously doing at the Equitable, big, big client, big, big uh, house for, for tech. They, they're known for their tech. Talk about the customer presence here and how you've weaved them into the whole story. Yeah, big, big customer presence. We, we tried to get about a third of the house full of uh, customers and about a third um, of partners, which are also very important for us today. And uh, the thing about having a big customer presence and, and some of the biggest of the big, I was just talking to the, the guy from Pfizer earlier, um, you, you know, they see the big data problem. And we've got a, you know, we can address that problem. You know, if you like the small businesses, they've got a small data problem, we, and we can address that too at, a, at an affordable price. And so, the the, the customers, I think, uh, seeing you know the the array of products that we had, uh, something of interest, and the channel partners who are going to go sell to that low end, uh, they do too. You guys aren't holding back anything on the on the on the marketing side. Obviously, you guys got some acquisitions. You know, historically, some really good ones. You got Data Domain, Green Plum, and now Isilon. You guys are just plugging them right in. No conflict at all. Just on the branding side, just plugging them right in. How does how that work out for you? Well, it works well because um, you know the, we, we've got our, our differentiation is our breadth, right? So we, we've got our uh, VNX and VMAX product lines for enterprise data. The whole new world of big data has got a different design point, and so Isilon fits right in there. And and look, you, you got a hint of Isilon today, but we've not even got going with Isilon yet. So uh, watch this space. What's your vision for the uh, the next step, the evolution for the EMC brand? Obviously, you guys are coming out of the, coming out of the tech business where your leadership is strong. You now have an entry level. You're going after a price point under 10k. Yeah. You certainly put the heat on uh, the competition. Um, but you know, you guys are going to be a big brand. You've got a lot of breath. You own VMware. Mm -hmm. How are you guys going to tie all that together? And what's next for EMC? It's pretty simple. You know, three words: cloud meets big data. Four words. <laughs> I mean, we, we, you talked last year about cloud and, and the journey to the cloud. That's a huge part of our story, continues to be a huge part of our story, and then this new world of big data. And, and what you see really is EMC sitting at that intersection point between cloud and big data. Talk about the record breakings here. I mean, obviously you have the Mini Cooper, 26 people in a Mini Cooper. You had the video of the motorcycle jumping over. How many VMAX drive yeah, systems? 40, I think. 40 yeah. VMAX drives. Um, what other records are you guys touting here that are kind of interesting, notable? Well, we, we, we didn't show them here today, but um, out in the UK, we are building a monument to tape. You know, it's, we think it's really, you know, it's sad. It's the death of tape. So we built, if you like, a, a monument or an obelisk. We have the world's biggest tape ball. It's about, because uh, it's in Europe, it's 1.6 meters in diameter. So we'll be in the, in the uh, Guinness Book of World Records for that. And also out in Singapore, um, yesterday, uh, they uh, broke the world record for breaking the most vinyl records. So they had a martial arts team in Singapore uh, break 50 vinyl records in 30 seconds. So you know, to illustrate the speed. So we had a lot of fun, not just here in New York, but around the world. So what would you think of Pat Gelsinger and Joe Chucci's performance today? Obviously, they're up on stage. You know, yeah. these are tech geeks, executives. I mean, they played well with the theme. There was a lot of sizzle out there. You did a great job. Yeah. It was really a lot of energy. It wasn't goofy. It was really clever and smart. So yeah. what would you think of their performance? I thought they were dynamite. You know, you know Joe, at, at, uh, he keeps he keep saying he's only got a few more years left, but I, I, I hope he keeps going a lot longer. I thought he was dynamite. And, 
you know, the tough thing with Pat is, is he's got a lot to cover. He's got to keep it moving and keep it interesting for the audience. And I thought he did a fantastic job of weaving in, you know, the video content as well as the, the live stunts. And sometimes it's a little bit disoriented when, when all that stuff's going on on stage. But I, I thought he nailed it. I thought he did fantastic. Congratulations. Everything's unified here at EMC. The whole team is unified. The messaging's tight. A lot of fun. Great event. Congratulations. We're here at Jeremy Burton, SiliconAngle.com. He's the man behind the curtain. Actually out on stage today, put this whole deal together. Record-breaking event. Mega launch in New York City, off to London and Singapore. L L London, we leave 1 o'clock this afternoon, head off to London. Yeah, do the same thing again. Congratulations. Right, thanks.